What up, man? This is your boy Shark 360 from Man This is a comment. Here we go with the perfect defense video, and we're gonna play against NCL Madden Swag, who's actually ranked around 10 in the world for Madden. So I'm PS4. So let's go ahead and get started in this game. And again, I want to thank you guys for liking the video. We're almost at 32,000 subscribers. So uh, let's go ahead and get started with this, guys. Make sure you guys subscribe, like, and comment if you have any questions about what I'm doing here on defense. So. This is perfect defense number eight. So let's go ahead and continue with the series since you guys like it so much. And here we go, coming out in 4-3, white nine. And we're gonna come out in Sam Blitz three. And I'm gonna go ahead and try to see what he likes to run. I have never played him before in my life. He's coming out with the, the, uh, the Ravens. I'm pretty sure he's gonna do a screen to the left. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this guy manned up with a Y or with triangle. Now he's blocking a lot of people. He noticed, he probably noticed that I'm gonna go ahead and send a blitz. So. He's blocking the running back, and uh, I noticed that he threw a little route uh, that I'm going to have to adjust to as we progress in this game. Uh, Got to be ready for the screens because a lot of the top 100 players, of course, like screen screens. And here we go with a bunch weak. I believe this is bunch weak or bunch tight end. So uh, we're going to go ahead and guard the middle of the field just in case anything comes across or the running back likes to come out in a little delayed blue route. So here we go. You guys can see there we sent the blitz. Actually, this is like a little stream. He put number 14 there on the drag, and he actually uh, got a first down. So I'm going to have to adjust to that and be ready. So as you guys can see here, it's coming out on the slip screen. Uh, this is the same tactic they used to use last year uh, before, but it was used actually a lot from the split close formation. So uh, as you guys can see here, he's using a bunch tight end, the little screen, and he came out and got a nice first down. So uh, here we go again. We're going to go ahead and lurk the middle of the field. Comes in deep. And, nope, uh, he's not going to get that against me because, uh, again, remember, guys, we talked about the deep ball hog. So if you guys didn't see that series, uh, make sure you guys go check it out. It tells you exactly how to defend the deep ball. And you guys can see here resulted in an incomplete pass. It should have been picked off, though. So, uh, here we go. We're going to go ahead and direct the middle of the field. As you guys can see here, he's coming on the formation. Got to be ready. I'm manning them up both just in case he comes out on the screen. So I'm lurking in the middle of the field. There we go. And the blitz comes off the edge. And that's right there. Uh, perfect. Perfectly uh, caught the, the right place. And the blitz with the right outside linebacker. And we get a nice sack. And we're going to go ahead and continue right here. Uh, man up that slot. And man up that wide receiver on the left just in case he comes out on the screen. And put him right next to the... It's a lot of receiver because that wheel rod is giving me a lot of problems. Look at that. It's like a wheel rod, but it's coming to the inside. It's definitely giving me a lot of problems. A lot of the top 100 players love to pass, guys. They love to pass. I, on the other hand, my style is more of a runner. 60% uh, runner, 40% pass. A lot of the top 100 players are actually 70% pass, 30% run. So uh, you got to be ready for that. How do I adjust to all the different kind of passes now? He's coming out again. Two wide receivers on the left side. I'm right in the middle of the field with the middle linebacker and guarding the tight end first and we get underneath all those two routes and we get the nice user pick in this play so that was a really nice play and a really nice defensive series in this uh game so we're doing really good we're back on defense we did not we only score like three points and we're gonna go ahead and try to adjust now we've been adjusting pretty good we're basically locking him up on defense he's struggling with a pass but again he throws deep and he got the user catch this time. I'm going to go ahead and give that to him right there. He went up for it. He caught it. So I got to be a little bit ready uh, for that. I got to be ready for that. For getting the deep throw. He already, this is the second time he throws it. So I got to expect for him to throw it once again. So again, he throws it. This time, was, he, he actually did not throw it right. I was right there. Quarterback over to that. As you guys can see, he's coming down the cowboy hook. So he's using... Probably like Cowboys Playbook or a custom Cowboys Playbook, either or. Uh, those hooks are pretty glitchy. I've used them before in uh, other Maddens and it seems like it's still pretty glitchy. And again, he does not get it. I'm just guarding the ball pretty good. I'm just pressing the ball hawk. My player gets in the right position. And he actually, you know, as you guys can see, um, he's having a hard time catching the ball. I don't know if he would have had a different receiver. Maybe he would have brought that down. But right now, he's having a hard time catching the ball. And my cornerback is not the tallest cornerback in the world. So, uh, as you guys can see here, I'm manning up the defensive end with a corner, uh, with a slot receiver, the linebacker over there with that, that wide receiver up from south side. And I, everybody's covered really good. And again, he throws down the middle. I locked down that tight end who was probably his second read. 
and he throws it there but i am right there on the spot and uh still three to zero i cannot score uh, he's stopping my run basically that's what he's doing so again we're gonna adjust the same thing he's coming in the same formation so i'm gonna do the same adjustments and he's blocking everybody so that base won't get in there but again look at how tall his wide receiver is compared to my cornerback again that baja tip does work guys if you guys have not used that baja tip all right hey you're missing out hey you need to go ahead and check out those videos anyways uh here we go we're gonna go ahead and uh put uh cover quarter three man deep and the reason we do this is because it's uh he's gonna throw deep and it's almost at the end of the second half and that's the defense that you want to use or i suggest you guys use in this type of situation every single time i've used cover four before i use cover three those formations get beat mostly every single time i try them uh I, they score a touch on me so never again you learn from your mistakes so you gotta go ahead and use make a quarter uh three deep uh defense just man man, man up man them all up and just stay there and just lurk with a safety or the linebacker this right here almost cost me but my safety were deep enough to recover and actually make the tackle right there so we're back on defense again the score 10 and 0 i'm winning right now so i gotta lock up on defense again he's coming on the same formation he audible to a spread formation over here actually five wide and i'm sending everybody so as you guys can see i'm sending everybody and i'm pressuring him to throw that route so he threw it right there so i gotta be aware with my middle linebacker of what he's doing uh, or anything coming across the field so here we go once again i'm gonna put this uh, run, uh linebacker on the right we're gonna blitz the right outside linebacker we're looking in the middle of the field he throws deep again and he doesn't get it so again i'm gonna be ready for the deep ball that's i guess that's one of his favorite plays the cowboy hooks if you guys want me to break down this play let me know how he uses how he usually catches with it i understand how he does it uh, i've done it in the years past if you guys want me to teach you guys how to use that play go ahead and put me in here and put just let me know in the comment section i'll be more than glad to break it down here we go coming across the field this time he got me good my biz didn't come in and he's almost about to score in the fourth quarter and um he's getting closer to score so you gotta be really careful especially with those crossing routes a lot of the players here at the tower 100 actually like to use like a lot of verticals a lot of crossing routes like that so you gotta be really careful with the middle linebacker or sending the blitz make sure you send an edge blitz that's gonna come in quick and right here we don't get anything everything is pretty much locked up and again we're coming out in the and uh 43 y9 but we could go ahead and say switch it up you come out and cover two cover four anything man coverage and here we go moving people down just in case because the safety is already uh in flat zone so we're gonna move everybody down we don't have to worry about anything deep you guys can see here moving the safety down so they could help me with the run a lot more and i got anything down the middle coming across the field or anything just uh the running back anything is coming down the middle to see what he wants here he's coming out in the bunch again i believe this is a bunch uh weak uh or the i don't know i need to check this cowboy's playbook though so i need to check what he's running there comes out right here and he scores so my play did not make the tackle so that's gonna happen hey scores are bound to happen everybody gets scored on uh, right here i do a turnover he gets a ball back i gotta go ahead and break the middle of the field here uh, and actually stop him and now he wins the game so uh we got one minute left with 54 seconds we adjust really good he runs the ball and we almost make him fumble and i always press the strip button every time i'm gonna go ahead and um and tackle instead of a hit sticky also we're coming out on a cover three uh, cover two invert out of three four uh three four bear uh because this run this play actually stopped the one really good and at the same time it has good coverage so and i'm containing the outside guys and as you guys can see there the blitz came in and we sacked so even though he missed the tackle he came back in and we sacked him so uh, that was a really nice blitz there again we're gonna come out and cover two him but he's having a hard time uh actually making a play happen uh with that defense so this is the ice sticks defense uh, he actually showed me the defense so uh here we go we're gonna go ahead and look the middle of the field and he doesn't get anything 
So let's go ahead and continue here. We are gonna go ahead and again combine the four bear nickel. Oh, okay, here we go in another series. One second left in this game. He decides to go ahead and throw it deep. And we're gonna go ahead and go into overtime since uh, actually he caught up there. So uh, make sure you guys pay attention to this drive because it's an overtime drive. So uh, make sure you guys are paying attention on how I adjust really good. And you know, make it happen on, on again, on defense. Defense wins game, guys. I'm telling you, it does win game. So let's go ahead and kick it off. On the kickoff, we wanna kick it deep. It's hard to return it but you also got to be careful just uh put people to the outside so he won't run it and make sure you guard the middle just in case he just goes straight up the gut and uh gets those uh you know that that yardage to get him a touchdown so here we go coming out and cover two invert we go ahead and set up our defense we're gonna go ahead and put uh manned up on the slot we're gonna put this guy uh, down next to the defensive end we blitz him there we're not containing because we're not afraid of Flacco running the ball. That's why we're not containing. So here we go. Now, look at this. Oh, he got me on the spin. Now, the New Zealand or, or NZL Man and Swag, who is actually from New Zealand. So he is uh, from another country. And, uh, you know, he's a pretty good player for being from New Zealand, man. So, But uh, today, hey, I'm going to lock, I'm going to lock him up. Man, I'm going to lock him up. Cover two invert. First you guys can see here, we're going to go ahead and again adjust. He's coming out in the same formation. Oh, wow. And he's probably coming, coming out in the, wide, in the cowboy hooks flip. And we're going to go ahead and look in the middle of the field. Oh, no. Nope. He throws right into coverage. Again, we manned them up, remember? Aldous Smith was a linebacker there. We manned him up there. We scored touchdown for the win in overtime with defense, guys. So this is how you win with defense. And go ahead and check out Madden Swags right here. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe for more. Check what it out. About, I'm telling you, man, you can't run that ball on me. Hey, I'll, I'll give you that, Shaka. I'll give you that. You couldn't run. I really couldn't pass. You got to admit when, when you're struggling on something, man. I'll give you that. Man, who doesn't beat OG? Wow, Baller does that shit? Damn. Hey, that's cool, Rickless. I I am Yeah, hey man, I, I don't take anything serious, uh Rickless. I just I'm just out here mucking around. It's it's just a video game. Know what I mean, it's just a video game, uh Rickless. You cool. Hey, Baller just sounds like a like a hillbilly. He just hasn't like gone through puberty properly. He just sounds funky, man. Hey, that's cool, Shaka. You you took that, man. You couldn't run, I couldn't pass. But at the end of the day, you picked it off him and took it to the house, man. You won. Exactly, Shocker. Gotta help uh, hype it up, man, to try and get that win, man. Legendary. I don't never heard of you, man. Exactly, Shocker, man. I, I ain't got no hard feelings, man. <laughs> Reckless man, you need to get some action with some girls, man, not in here, man. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe down here below for more tips, more strategies, more schemes, more gameplays, more tournaments, and more giveaway prices. Later, it's your boy Shock360. Hit that like button. Don't forget, comment, and subscribe.